Well, a mother and her son, they were out on a fishing expedition and they found something that's pretty unique, a class ring that is 84 years old. And their mission now is to find out how it ended up in the Minnesota lake where they discovered it and also track down its owner. Fox 32 Scott Schneider has more on this now unfolding mystery. A little rusty spot here. 11 year old Marshall Ammer is good at finding things. I was looking into buying one of these. These things are very expensive. They, these are like eight bucks, and I just wasn't into spending them until I found a sale. But this week, after picking up a few lures, he found a box. It was just sitting in the grass on the edge of Spirit Lake in Duluth, near where he and his family were camping and helping a family friend buff boats at the marina. But actually, this was full of garbage. Oh. And the boys picked up. It was like kind of where it was. Yeah. But it wasn't just any box. Inside, in there box. was a ring. Yeah. And no one has any idea how it ended up near the lake. I at first thought it was some, like, diamond ring made from real diamond, like mom's ring or something. <laughs> Marshall comes around the corner, and he, like, acts like he's squatting down, like, to kneel. And he's got the ring, you know, the box in his hand, like, you know, like he's going to propose. And he says, hey, Mom, will you marry me? <laughs> Yeah, I'm like, what? The ring is a Wyzetta High School ring from the class of 1939. It's gold, and inside there's an inscription that's a bit hard to read, but it appears to be GRT. While the box is a bit moldy, the ring is in just about mint condition. I thought it was just an ordinary ring until I showed mom, and now it's... It's not an ordinary ring, it's old. Now Marshall and his mom are on a new type of adventure, a new quest to find the person or the family this old high school ring might belong to. I'm really happy when I find the owner of something that is lost, and I'm really happy that they get it back, and, and yeah, it makes me happy. It just would feel sad to, you know, not try. Scott Schneider, Fox 32, Chicago. I hope they find Me who owns too. that ring. That's a cool. follow-up story.